Okay, we're in um, we're in Lydia Abbey. We're not actually one of the doorways to the old Abbey ruin. Uh, we're getting a lot of activity in this doorway at the moment. We've just literally come over, set up camera to finish off the little day, uh, the night. K2. <laughs> the K2 is oh, just being gone. I've just talked to someone's shadow. And that smell of alcohol is right, gone. I've got a strong smell of alcohol. I've put the REM pod down on the doorway because we've got this smell coming through. And the, the actual K2 is just being gone ballistic. Yeah, it's going again. It's starting again. Hello, are you here? Is it you we can smell of drink? Can you go towards that device on the floor? The orange box on the floor, can you touch it? You touch it, it creates sounds and lights. That's all it does. That smell's gone. And then that's what it I is said. It's that was, bizarre. It was it's really strong. Yeah. Obviously, it's a ruin. It's open. You know, obviously, you think there's people hanging around, but there's not a soul here. No. And they always got a pub over the other side of the road, over the other side of the fence in the car park. But this was strong as it's going off the k2 is going off as well but it seems to be reacting at the same time we mentioned the alcohol it's important to stress as well there's there's a main road not too far away it's about what 200 yards yeah 200 yes. yards 300 mm -hmm. yards away so there, there's a little bit of noise coming through with the traffic uh and just touching on what alan's just said about the smell uh the best way to describe it for you guys at home is uh you know the alcohol hand gel that's what it smelled like and the first thing i did was accuse the pair of them so which one's washing your hands i can smell it yeah I, can, I carry it a lot <laughs> <laughs> neither, neither of them neither of them are using it so we always get the blame but it was like it was strong wasn't it yeah, yeah neat yeah. like neat vodka maybe or you know uh a, a, a neat spirit they could have gave me a uh, excuse that. the pun pun with that one <laughs> well let's just let's just it's just a little couple of seconds just call out because as soon as we mentioned it this one off didn't yeah, it yeah it did and Aaron, hold it towards you again, see if we get a reaction. Yeah, go. so again, as soon as you, you turn it over. As soon as you mention this, you mention this, this alcohol. Is it you who's here? Are you a drinker? Did you like a drink? Is it you we can smell? This alcohol. Are you here with us? Are you curious to why we're here? Right, okay. So anyway, so anyway, guys. So anyway, guys. So anyway, guys. So anyway, guys. Sorry, I just heard something clang. Is the K2 is that. going as well? It sounded like a stone hit. Yeah. Floor. Okay. Okay, guys. This. Sorry, I just heard something clang. Is the K2 is that. going as well? It sounded like a stone hit. Yeah. Floor. Okay. Okay, guys. Sorry, I just heard something clang. Is the K2 is going that. as well? It sounded like a stone hit. Yeah. Floor. Okay. Okay, guys. Sorry, I just heard something clang. Is the K2 going as well? Sound like a stone. Hit yeah. Floor. Okay. Okay, guys. Sorry, I just heard something clang. Is the K2 going that. as well? Sound like a stone. Hit yeah. Floor. Okay. Okay, guys. We're going to leave you just now, I said, because we're going to continue. Shit. Oh my God. This, we're going to leave you just now, I said, because we're going to continue. Shit. Oh my god! So, because we're gonna continue, so, because we're gonna continue, so, because we're gonna continue, so, because we're, so, we're gonna continue. Okay, I just Sorry for the language. Right, guys, we're gonna cut this. We need to cut it now because we need to investigate the police just for a couple of seconds, okay? Can you affect this device here? That's all it does. It will not harm you. I promise you that. All that does, it gives me an indication that someone like yourself is here and maybe willing to speak to us. Can you touch that for me? Please try. Then maybe we can ask you some more questions. Do you want to speak to us? Again, I asked if you're a man of the cloth. If you are, then light this device up for me. If you're a man of the cloth, light this device up for me. Step forward, come close. Again, light the box on the floor, it won't harm you. Are you still here? You are, thank you. Thank you for that. Okay, now, I know it's a lot to ask, 
but use the energy that's available to you. The box on the floor. Can you touch the box, wave your hand, or move close to it? All that does is create lights, like the green light here. Can you do that for me? You can. Please try a little bit harder. I know you can do the green light and the one in my hand, but go towards the box on the floor. Do you want me to step back? Do you want me to step away and give you room? I'll take a couple of steps back. You go towards that device on the floor. It creates lights like you're doing here. So again, if you're a man of the cloth, you once preached in this, in this abbey? Is this correct? Why do you stay here? Was you happy in your place of worship? Were you happy here? Okay, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna take the REM pod, I'm gonna move it a bit further down the ruin. Okay, I've moved a little bit further down. If you're here, enter the abbey, come through towards the doors, or the openings in this abbey, come towards me, come towards my voice. Again, if you are here, can you affect the green light in my hand? Show me that you're here. I've come here to talk to you Take this opportunity to talk. Do we have any children then present? I think apparently there was children buried in the grounds here, as well as um, Jesuit priests. Um, I'm not too sure whether on the far side there's a couple of gravestones, or maybe we'll look over there a bit later on. Do we have any children? Are you present here? Any children here in the abbey or in the grounds of this cemetery? If you wish to speak to me, come towards this device in my hand. Wave your hands in front of it. Do you want to speak? I, I thought I saw a shadow by the doorway. But I think I just debunked it. I think there's cars on the outside over the... Yeah, is the K2 is going. You are here. Thank you. I thought I'd seen a shadow. I wasn't sure whether it was the cars going past. I just looked up for a moment. And the K2 is just gone as well. So you are a child. Have you come closer? Are you wondering what this is in the, in the man's hand? He can actually see you. Do you want to show yourself? be fantastic if you can touch the box on the floor that will be brilliant can you do that for me i know it's a lot to ask use a bit of my energy use a bit of the people's energy that's here now in this abbey can you do that again all this does is create lights so if you can step forward and touch this device Show me that you're here and you can hear my voice. You can maybe throw something here towards me. Can you move something? If you don't want to speak, affect this device now. The one in my hands or the one on the floor. If you don't want to speak anymore. I just thought I heard somebody shout my name. I'm around the outside of the Abbey now. Um, K2's been going off. Um, so if we have a walk round, 
Is there anybody here? Is somebody following me? Or just shouted my name? Can you do it again, please? Can you do it louder? Come to these lights in my hand. Is there a little boy called Charlie here with me? Charlie, we've been so many times here. And you always make yourself be known to us. Can you do that now for us, please? As you can see, you can see inside the abbey where the old bell tower is. We come as friends, we don't mean any disrespect to any of you that are here. We do know there's a graveyard attached to the abbey. So again, we know we, we don't mean any disrespect to you, but we do know this is it's quite an active location. Sorry, that's just me. So Charlie, I know I'm concentrating on you. You're a little boy, you're two years of age. Are you here with us now? You are, thank you. Can you come closer to me, please? Charlie, can you remember from last time where you can see that orange light, that bright light? We call it a candle. If you go towards that, because you used to sit on that um, little step there. If you're here, can you go towards that for me, please? I'll just make a few lights and a noise. Nothing else. You can come and hold my hand and touch it if you can, if you're frightened, because you used to like holding my hand. Yeah, you did. We sat here, didn't we? And you held my hand. So here, let me show you how it works. You've not seen this before. That's all it does. Can you do that for me? If I put that down, you can hold my hand and you can touch that. Can you do that for me? Just the once, and then we'll step back. Are you still here, Charlie? Come to the green light in my hand if you're still here. If there's anybody else here who wishes to communicate with us, please do so. I wander over a little bit. Charlie, if you're still sat on that little stub, you please. You can touch that and it won't do you any harm. It won't hurt you at all. Let's take a walk over. You're most welcome to come with me. Thank you. You are with me, aren't you? Thank you. You are. Can you make it go to red? Thank you very much. You are still here. You have. I don't know if you are buried in this graveyard. I don't know, sweetheart. And I don't know why you'd still want to be here. Can you do something for me? Make yourself be known to us. Make me yourself be known to everybody. Previous visits, we've had EVPs um, from here when myself and Aaron were by ourselves. Um, and it sounded like Sutar. Um, so if anybody can look that name up for us and let us know what it means, it'd be brilliant because I can't find it. Um, I didn't know if it was Latin, um, with it being a nabby. Um, okay, I've just seen a light shine at the back. It was if, like it was something was running at the back. I don't want to run too fast because I don't want to fall, but it just looked like there was somebody just... Hello? If that was you that I've just seen, please can you come forward? Come back, we don't mean you any harm. I mean you no harm at all. It was, then it was just like a quick flash of somebody running right past. If that was you, make yourself be known. Let's see you walking. So you are male. Were you a man of the cloth? If so, step towards the green light. I've just heard like, the only way to describe it was like very, very, very light uh, footsteps in the leaves next to me. Could be a bug, um, but, or a mouse maybe. Oh, 
Are you a soldier? If so, step towards the green light. Funny, I remember on a previous investigation going back a good few years ago, uh, we were testing out uh, the first sort of uh, wave of um, spirit boxes, uh, they're known as FB7s now, mainly, but we had a little uh, Radio Shack hack spirit box and we sat in the doorway of the um, of the chapel and we had French, like French words coming through, um, which sort of suggests possible you know, ties in with France, French, French troops maybe, I mean French people. I mean, this chapel actually was attached to a big manor house, as we said before. Um, so it, it's just, I mean, there's so much has gone on on this particular area. Um, it, it, it's difficult to say what we're, who we're communicating with. Um, are you a roundhead? Parliamentarian? Or a royalist? Oh, K2 went. Are you a royalist? Come towards the green lights if you are a royalist. Now, if I recall, it's something I'll have to check on. I'm almost certain Henry VIII actually uh, demolished or made that chapel into a ruin. Uh, again, it's something I have to check on. It might be just hearsay or whatever, or um, the, oh, K2, uh, the king of the country at the time. Is Henry VIII your king? Did you hide from Henry VIII? Thank you. Did this man try to destroy the Catholic faith? I've got the only way to describe pins and needles up my face, both sides of my cheeks. It's like, like some sort of energy. Did you manage to get away from Henry VIII's army? Or were you unfortunately slain by them? So I keep looking out to, to where the, the gravestones are and I can see my own shadow because there is the street lighting sort of illuminates yourself a little bit from the other side on the main road. Uh, but you keep looking backwards and forwards because you, you think you're seeing dark shapes dodging the stones and, and a, a lot of it might be matrixing and things like that, but just it plays with your imagination massively. <laughs>